Those in need during these challenging times can go a long way. Rob Pace, founder of Express Feedback for Good, joins us now to discuss the importance of giving back to the community, especially during times like these. And he also has some words of wisdom for business owners who are struggling. Rob, good morning. Good morning. All right, first of all, let's talk about your organization. Tell us about it. So uh, the company that I founded and I'm privileged to lead is named 100X. And we actually have a really, uh, we're fortunate to have a, a business model where we make money giving away money to charities because we solve an important business problem, but the way we do it results in us giving millions of dollars away in philanthropy. So you make money by giving away money. That, that raises eyebrows. Uh, give us a little idea how that, the business model is. Yeah, so the, the business problem we're solving is leaders, particularly large organizations, really need to be able to listen and hear from just regular customers. But survey is very broken. And so what we do is we realize there's so much passion to support nonprofits and they have such a, a, a passionate audience. We basically say, we're gonna create the easiest fundraiser ever. You go on and you sign up to support your nonprofit and you just give opinions on the companies you know every day and uh, you click them out and, and we give $2 for every, but it takes about a minute for every one you do. So we often write checks of six figures plus to nonprofits. And then we anonymize that data and, and provided it to businesses so they can hear the truth. Wow, congratulations, sir. Uh, that, what, a great, uh, what a great idea, a win-win for everybody. So uh, let's talk a little bit. You know, we saw a figure up there, $2 million given away. It was that 19, 2019 alone, or is that since your company has been on its feet? No, that's just in, in frankly, the last few months. So, Whoa. Uh, and our, our aspiration is to give away a lot more than that, Paul. All right, so Rob, you, uh, what do you say to small business owners? You know, we were talking about Winston's, uh, a very hot bar music place in OB, and we just got, I got a, an email from a uh, from Mary Ann Chamberlain saying, "Winston's, it's an it's an institution. I met both my husbands there. It, it, it's that kind of business that we're losing. You know, they're part of our, the fabric of our communities. What's your advice to them?" Well, it's the hundred year flood for a lot of businesses, right? And when you're in the hundred year flood, you just have to to hang on. And what I would say is to to small businesses, you're absolutely right. They're the fabric of our society. And I think if they can think about the mission, the people they employ, the, the customers they impact every day, that's kind of the key to getting through this. And then all of us who can help raise money for causes and support them, that's 